What's good, Stop Nation? Stop T here, and today we have had like teams with you know lots of master players. We've had our first legendary players. We've had Petit, we've had Adeli Ali, we've had Cristiano Ronaldo. But today we are about to put it all together for our first full eleven players. All of them legendary players on the squad. A 102 overall team that we got here. So we're going to go through the teams. We're going to do some gameplay. An unfortunate thing happened where we made it to FIFA Champion. And then we went on a very big losing streak. And now we are no longer in FIFA Champion. So we got to get back to FIFA Champion so we can actually play in the tournaments. So we're going to try and do this here. Maybe if we do that, we'll be able to put a live stream together or something like that in the next little while. But in our team right now, we have at the front, we got Cristiano Ronaldo at our left wing position. If we look at this this card right here wicked card right here 107 sprint speed 93 acceleration 103 dribbling 106 reactions 106 finishing 105 positioning the card gets better and better the higher this card goes so a very nice card to start leveling up we have a few things available we can actually go up a little bit more i just don't have any of the any coins for it but we can go up three extra levels on this card which would make it absolutely beastly so once we get some more coins we'll probably keep leveling that cristiano ronaldo card up in the middle we got messi 107 sprint uh, 100 7 x sprint speed okay acceleration 96 sprint speed 107 acceleration 110 dribbling 101 ball control 100 short passing we other also have another option up front here looking at this card right now this acrom card is another beastly card 112 sprint speed 121 acceleration pretty good dribbling and ball control as well great strength 107 um both cards very beastly right there uh, a lot better finishing um with the messy card uh better shot power better long shot better positioning um but not quite the same on the speed and then we got our other player we got michael owen in there as well with one away finishing 98 shot power 99 positioning 98 ball control 97 dribbling um and decent uh decent stats all around pretty much on that card so we're gonna go with messy for this gameplay because i know a lot of you want to see that messy uh card from there and then when we go on to our other side we got our uh what is it the what is the flash sale the flash sale our 100 overall flash sale master card right here um so a wicked card again 98 pace 109 acceleration 72 strength 97 ball control one way dribbling um 93 finishing 103 reactions 97 long shot um 99 crossing so a very good card all around helps us out with the french too so when we have those french icons coming in we can get that as well and then onto the other side we got our left mid Depay, our Netherland player, our best like left back or not left back, left mid right now on the team with 111 pace, 116 sprint speed, 107 acceleration, 108 dribbling, 103 reactions, 93 finishing, 97 finish positioning, 102 shot power, 99 long shot, 105 free kick. This is our free kick taker. He actually got a higher free kick than Ronaldinho in this one, so he doesn't have the special like anything like special when he lines up for it. Gareth Bale does though. Gareth Bale actually lines up for the knuckleball, which is kind of cool. So that that's very like that's an interesting one so we'll see i don't think he takes any of our free kicks though because the is so much higher on that one but anyways into the middle we got pate we got our arsenal icon our legendary icon that's that's kind of interesting we got legendary icons now on this squad as we go uh 106 sprint speed 104 acceleration 125 tackling 120 marking 123 aggression 117 strength 114 ball control 95 dribbling 102 heading 101 shot power 113 long shot 116 positioning this car is basically like can be in any position you could put this card in any position and you would be an absolute beast of a card that is this is like one of the most insane cards and especially because you could actually get it uh, i think you need like 85 overall team with five french players on it. one of the easier players to actually pick up for the icons as well and one of the best to get so he's in the central defensive of course we're playing the 343 diamond i'm gonna try and find some formation to, to beat on that one because this is one of the hardest formations to get past um, it really clogs with the middle everything that's why you see everybody using this one because it's like oh well it's like the easiest one to kind of go with um and have everybody sort of in the middle there but we're gonna go to our next player Deli Ali, and this is our highest card we have. We actually at the point where we can rank him up. Uh, we just need to get a couple uh, 95 plus players. It's, it's kind of I don't really want to do it though because it's a lot of players to put in. Um, you know, 95 plus players, especially so early in the season to rank it up. But you do get ranked up. We might do that in a little bit if we have some like a couple extra players that we're not planning on using in that position. But again, great stats: 115 sprint speed, 118 acceleration, 120 ball control, 129 dribbling, not 120 dribbling, 129 dribbling, 125 long shot, 120. 
20 positioning. We got great long shots on some of these things. I just don't shoot from long, so I got to learn to shoot from a bit longer because these players are great on there. On the other side, 115 pace on Gareth Bale. He's got the speed boost as well. A speed demon on the right mid side as well. 120 sprint speed, 109 acceleration, 99 box draw, 109 dribbling, 108 finishing, 106 shot power, 108 reactions. A great card right there. I don't know. Our, yeah, our Reese Nelson card is not 100 overall. Uh, we were trying to get that. We're almost there to get this card to 100 overall as well, um, but that is at a 99 overall, unfortunately. Not quite there to get our Arsenal player um, on the right mid as well. And then on the back, we grinded through some of these campaigns. We have Thiago Silva here as our campaign master. Our first boost actually hit an elite boost. Love the look of that elite boost right there. So we got two players being boosted by 10 on this one. It's going to cost us 300,000 these 225 skill boosts to get to the next level. It basically seems like it's doubling each time. So by the end, it's going to take you quite a bit to get it to level 20. But there is our card right there. A great card. 104 defending. So 113 tackling. 101 marking. 104 awareness. 105 reactions. 101 strength. A beautiful, beautiful card. And then in the middle. And this is one of those ones um, I kind of just went because he was 100 overall. I probably put the Sergio Ramos card in because he is a bit better of a card. But 106 tackling. 93 marking. 92 aggression. Very composed. I don't know if that really helps the defense in this one. It would seem like something that would help them. 95 awareness. 104 reactions. You'd be like, okay, you know what? That probably will help out my defenders. But I'm not sure how much it actually has to do with um, in-game performance there. We do as well have, uh, we have Koscielny and we have Sergio Ramos. Sergio Ramos definitely a little bit better of a card but then it doesn't make a full legendary team so we can't really put him in until I have enough to level him up one more and then Maldini love this card art as well a great card 108 tackling 108 marking 98 aggression 120 composure 112 awareness so it's max composure 100 acceleration 89 sprint speed 92 strength 106 heading 124 positioning great great card right there I do want to check one time because I wasn't really paying too close attention to the free kick so 105 free kick actually Bale and Depay have the same free kick a Depay seems to be the one that's taking our free kicks for us so which is interesting and then finally this Yashin card this was we were debating do we want to go Yash do we want to go Buffon both cards great cards but once we started getting them on the same level this card right here 118 goalkeeper diving 116 positioning 113 reflexes 111 handling and 111 reactions a great great card if we look to swap in our Buffon card also 100 overall um, but not quite on the same level of stats as that uh, Yashin card so you can see a huge difference once they start to get into this level uh, between Yashin and Buffon so interesting Interesting in that is Buffon was very high, but then uh, Yashin and him taking over. There is also the campaign version of Buffon, uh, but we haven't really grinded through that campaign yet. We've only done the three three campaigns and almost finished the Pogba campaign but there it is there is our full legendary team we're gonna go and we're gonna try and grind our way back to this FIFA champion we are at 967,000 fans every time we get like one win away we end up getting a match that we just can't win yeah we did like I guess 118 team or something like that but we're gonna try it here we're gonna see what we can do hopefully this first match will go well for us as we go into it 102 for our team Messi in the middle Ronaldo in the middle 100 overall on the other side so a very close match I'm gonna say they're, they're like counting themselves out, but I really think that this probably will be close. A, a two overall difference does not really make a big difference um, in like how the teams play. So we're going to try this here. Especially when we're just like not even able to do anything with it. And that's the problem with some of these formations is getting past them. Messi coming in though. Ramos is going to go there. Light touch on it because I always hit the crossbar every time we're going with that. Cristiano Ronaldo, he's coming in. We're going to try out his cross in here. Cross in and a beautiful header. Two to one right now. As we're going in, coming down the wing. Here we go. Perfectly timed rainbow. Perfectly timed rainbow. Got to do it one more time. I was worried. I was so worried my player was going to step in the way. Uh, because that tends to happen. You're, you're like going in really well. And then your own player like steps in the way there. Another nicely placed shot. That's what I got to get in the habit of doing is shooting from further out. Um, I'm, I'm still used to like when you're doing like FIFA Mobile last time. Where you try and like get it like super close in. Uh, doesn't really work for me. And then we end up doing stuff like that. Because their defense is a lot of speed on defense this season. I'm finding a lot more speed in general on the players. That was poor choice. Alright, here we go. They score. So we got to get this corner here. We got to get the corner and a basely header right there. That's the way you want to see it. So Messi coming in. Ronaldinho scores for their team. Messi can't get there. Ali cannot come back. Deli Ali cannot come back to it. Although I don't really want to win. I just want them to clear. So here we go. Great chance right now. Finally picking up the great chances. Deli Ali going for the chip of the keeper. He's going to chip it. It's going to go in 6-5. to five. 12 seconds left. It's going to be a close match here at the end. Deli Ali, he's going to rainbow flick it up. He's got to put it in. And a save from the keeper. I cannot believe he saved that. Great chance right now. 2-0 on o with the keeper. They put it in. 
Why wasn't he shooting? Why didn't he shoot that? Oh my goodness. I don't know why he didn't shoot that, but they ended up pulling out the win. So they were concerned about it, but they ended up getting the win somehow in that one anyways. All right, here we go into this match, seeing how we're going to do in this next one. Uh, 99 overall team, so close, using that diamond formation again. Uh, but we're going to go into this. We're going to see how we can do. So hopefully we'll get a couple chances in this one. All right, Messi. Not the way we wanted to go, but I guess we'll take it as we go. We can't get the rainbow flick again. Way too many players in there. The rainbow flick is not an effective strategy once people got this diamond formation going in. Top of the box, strike, but way over the bar. Way over the bar right there. It's Messi coming in again. One-on-one -on -one with Petit. He's going to get past Petit. Just got to beat the keeper, and he's going to do it. He's going to put it in the back of the net right there. We're going to start this onto the other side. Rainbow flicks it up. Got a rainbow flick Maldini, rainbow flicks Maldini, puts it in 2 to nothing. They're in the clear though, and you can never be careful. You can never, you can never let up in these ones because usually what happens is then they get it at the end as we go. Delhi Alley gets the keeper going the wrong way. They're starting to put in their goals a little bit quicker now. That's what I'm saying. Once they get, once you get like good opportunities, you don't know what the other team's opportunities are like, and that's part of it. As we go, oh, what a beautiful goal off the keeper and in. A nice shot that right there is Messi's going to try and use some speed to get away from the defense. Petit tries to stay on him, can't stay with him, um, but the keeper's going to make the save for them anyways as we go on the corner. The corner, I can't, I don't know what's happening to my corners. My corners are just not working for me right now, but we got a great chance. That's what we needed. That's what we needed, and that is going to go in 5-4. to four. We need a couple more of those great chances, I think, as we go. Messi's coming in one-on-one -on -one with Maldini, goes up shot goal six to four six seconds left and a great chance hopefully this will be what we need in order to finish this off as we go across puts it in Messi off the bar and in and seven to five should hopefully get us the win in this match there you go seven to five they actually had more chances than us which is crazy so they actually had more chances in total than us um so equal on the great chances had a couple extra chance but we did end up getting that victory there so a nice play uh by the team to get the victory for us all right here we go next match 102 we are going against 101 overall so a close matchup right here we can do in this one so they're gonna have a little bit better or i think we actually have a little bit better that's what i should say we have a little bit better opportunity there are already laughing at us we haven't even started the match they don't even know how bad we play and then they're already laughing at us here we go Messi, top of the box can't get it in the net we're gonna waste a little bit of time on this corner but hopefully my corner action will actually result in a goal which it does the first time we're getting a goal in a little while on those corners as we go so a rainbow flick there into the box rainbow flick again to get past diego silva gets it past the keeper we're going up 2-1 right now deli alley deli alley with the rainbow gets the cross across here takes the strike the save by the foot and no 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 it's not gonna get it in can't win i cannot win these headers against these defenders we are just not not going well when you try and do that as we go across again deli alley can't pick it up in the middle of the box 44 seconds left in this match deli alley's at the top they're putting in again Deli Ali with the strike puts it in three to three right now where are all these great chances at deli alley scores messy all right, Diego Silva's in there. Messi shot again. The bar. The bar is just, ah, uh, destroys me. It, ah, uh, it frustrates me so much, that bar. All right, here we go. Messi. Messi coming up. Messi coming up in the box. They lose possession, so it gives us slight chance. But still, they're finally, finally we get a great chance. Finally we get a great chance going, and we put it in. We make a count when we get that great chance as we go. Cristiano Ronaldo to Messi in the middle. Messi loses it. Two seconds. And Deli Ali, of course, scores. And no time left. We don't get that other one. Um, that was uh, really unfortunate. There are three great chances to my one. Really? Off the bar and in seven seconds. We just can't let them score. I guess we don't really have a whole lot of control over that. But they do anyways. And we put it in seven to seven. So we'll get the tie there. So at least we got a tie out of that one unless they're getting the goal after, which probably will happen. Nope, it didn't happen. So luckily it didn't happen um, in that one. We ended up getting the tie out of that match. So we're going for the next one, 945. Still a bit of a grind to get back to FIFA champion, but we'll see what we can do. We're going one more, one more, one more rainbow flick puts it in five to four. Okay, we need to keep this momentum going. We have the lead right now, which means we just got to score when they score. As we go, Deli Alley's going to chip the keeper, goes in. They're on a breakaway, so we need to keep our momentum going because we know they're scoring on this breakaway. It's almost like guarantee that the other team's going to get a goal on the breakaway as we go. Waste way too much time there and unfortunate for that one as we go. But Messi, way too far back, way too far back, Messi. Okay, here we go. Deli Alley. 
Deli Alley. They put one in. We try from the top, puts it in from very far out, and a great chance to finish this off with five seconds left. If we can get this in, that should hopefully seal it, and it's not going to go in because we get... Wow, they disconnected. All right, so they disconnected at the end. As we go, and oof, what a goal. What a goal to finish it off. So we finish off with a goal right there. Eight to six in that match. Um, so not a bad way to finish it. All right, so there you have it. There's some gameplay with our uh, squad. Um, so thank you for checking this out and stopping by. It's been a pleasure as always. Stop D, out.